Hi, Scott with FDJTool.com here. And I'm sure a scene like this looks really familiar to you. I know over the years, solders and fluxes have improved greatly, but when you're soldering, you really don't want to be breathing the fumes that they produce. And most of us don't have the luxury of having a professional ventilation system installed in our workshops. That's why we have brought to you these two great products that help make your soldering experience safer and more enjoyable. We've got the SO950 tabletop fume extractor and the SO949 adjustable fume extractor. They're great products to have on your workbench to make things safer and cleaner and smell better, maybe? But let me show you just how wonderful they are. Now one reason that these fume extractors are great to have is because they feature very quiet and very powerful high output fans. The fans on each of these fume extractors can pull up almost 1.4 cubic meters of air through them per minute. And what does that mean? Well, in a room about 8 by 10, all of the air in that room can be pulled through one of these fans in just about 15 minutes. That's powerful. Now, how to use it? Well, if you've got a tabletop model, you're going to plug it in and turn it on and position it on your workbench so that you can draw the fumes away from your work, just like that. But if you don't have a lot of space on your workbench, a lot of us don't, the tabletop model might not be the best thing for you. No problem though. You can use the adjustable model. The adjustable model clamps on the side of your workbench and has this great arm that allows you to position it pretty much anywhere you need it in order to get those fumes out of the way. On top, on side, no problem. It's going to work great for you. And another reason that these fans work really well is because they feature carbon activated filters. Carbon activated filters the perfect kind of filter because those are the kind of filters going to draw the fumes and particulates that are produced during the soldering process. And they're replaceable. All you need to do is simply pop open the grate in the front of your fume extractor and the carbon filter simply pops out just like that. Put a new one in and you're ready to go. Of course now I know you're going to ask how often should I replace my filter? Well, of course it's going to depend on how much soldering work you do, but a good rule of thumb is to probably change it every couple of months. So there you have it, our fume extractors, our SO950 tabletop model and our SO949 adjustable model. You can find these fantastic products and many more at our website at fdjtool.com. Hi, I'm Scott with FDJ Tool. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Nice. Okay. All right, we ready? All right. Ready. Hi, I'm Scott with FDJTool.com, and I want. Okay, enough already. <laughs> All right, one more time. Hi, right. Scott with FDJTool.com. And I've, okay, that's it. I've had it, I'm out of here. <laughs> I've had it. I'm taking a break.